Hi folks, this is your old pal, Uncle Al. More coffee. Uncle Al's been busy. Okay, first thing, we have to talk about these people right here. I'm doing shout outs because this is important because YouTube's been scrambling up everybody's channels because A, YouTube's hiding the facts of China. They don't want you to know what's going on over there. And also, they're hiding people like Kirk Hermary of Red Deer, Canada. Detroit Prepping. Not because they're Canadian or black, but they don't like them. And who runs YouTube? Google. Who runs Google? The Chinese. Jack Pine Savage. Again, they don't want to hear them. Kansas Prepper. Again, YouTube again. Free America. The Scotch Channel. They're always trying to put you down or get rid of your channel or just block you. Shadow Scout Swede. That's your channel. God bless him. Where are you at? Prepping and Progress. Uh, let's talk about prepping. Budget, Bushcraft, and RV life. We all know what happened to him, but remember, folks, this is an important message. If you're in the Great Lakes region, be very careful. Next to feral people, we have an outbreak of possible, not reported yet, I can't confirm it, and I have to double check, of cannibalism. Now, a lot of people says, oh no, it's not related to the Red Dragon. Don't know, can't confirm it, confirm it yet. So be very careful, especially in the Columbus areas. I got some rumors, I have to double check. That's Urban Grandpa Prepper. No zombies, Ray. Cannibals. Second Star Survival. Again, Matt. No zombies. Possible cannibals. Mondak Living. Haven't heard anything. WD Rock and Roll. Again, possible, probable, feral people. Maybe cannibals. Can't confirm it yet. So I'm still researching that, folks. So please check out WD's channel, Working Good. We're going to have a nice warm wave. You can take down plastic. Make sure you vent out your greenhouse so they don't cook. SD Mountain Man. Okay. Again, unconfirmed reports. So be very nervous and pack. Carry, everybody. Maccabetus off grid, grid and everyday survival. People are getting crazy. Can't confirm it, but like I said, this is a cannibal alert, so please be careful when you're outside, folks. Now, after the first 100 days, everybody should be impeaching you-know-who. Biden's plan in helping the communists take over America in 2021 and enslave America. More riots. Do they go away? No. More BLM activities. Mo movements to eliminate Antifa or help them. Destroy the economy and food supply. Starve America, feed China. That was 4 8 21 end of USA. No federal backing of states. No, they're pushing all these idiot laws like, yes, gun control is bad for your health. Uh, if it's bad for your health, why don't you ban cars? The evil trio. Politicians, perverts, and terrorists. I didn't vote for these people, folks. So take a good look. Decide for yourself what you're going to do. And remember, it's a cannibal alert. This what I confirm. The guy of Facebook, I forgot his name again. Founder of Zach Zuckerberg and former President George W. Bush is working on the border thing. That doesn't sound right. Again, uh, where did I put my paper? I wrote down notes and I keep forgetting where I did it. Ah, oh, here it is. Okay. It's possible phase seven. And I keep forgetting phase seven because it's too horrifying. It deals with 
was our cannibal issue. Organ jackers or harvesters. Reality, it's really bad, folks. See phase five. They want your kids. They want anybody's kids. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's the border issue. They want those kids. They're trying to get unincorporated minors, and they're going to organ harvest them. Whereas phase, you can't stop. Well, seventh phase, you can't stop them. And November believes Uncle Alan, so like I said, do your own research. And if you get raided by the FBI, it's not my fault. Okay, now to make sure, you go check out Palmetto Prepared. Seven easy ways to find free food or source food out. One is gardening. That stays off cannibalism. Garden, everybody. You should be starting planting food in your garden. Another one is hunting. Be sure if you're doing hunting, you have somebody to teach you how to hunt and process the game. Don't get a gun and go wandering in the field shooting everything. Because some people get mad and take a pot shot at you or call, call the game warden. And make sure you take a hunter safety course and have a guide. Because a lot of you probably shoot Uncle Alan's cows. Okay, fishing is the easiest. Like Anthony on Palmetto Prepared explained, everybody can fish. You drop a line and sinker in a body of water. Make sure it's not a public pond or sewage pond. And you can catch fish. All right. Raise animals. Everybody could raise rabbits. On the West Coast, I do not recommend it at this time. Raise quail. We have hemorrhagic fevers going around that's affecting both rabbits and domestic rabbit domestic rabbits you do not want to get hemorrhagic fever okay you can raise small animals in the backyard chickens rabbits quails ducks um something small something easy to grow guinea pigs carp koi you name it crayfish not a problem Another thing is, and old school prepper did it, is foraging. Know where you forage. Make sure you, when you forage in a farmer's field, they didn't spray anything out there like insecticide, weed killer, fertilizer, a fungicide, anything out there because you'll be eating the weird chemicals. And on foraging, especially plant and mushroom foraging, take a class. It's an eight to six to eight weeks course at a local college and make sure you go out with somebody who has experience foraging. Trapping. Know your fishing game laws before you trap. You can box trap like rabbits again. I wouldn't do it right now because of the hemorrhagic fever. But trapping, boxing, box traps is very good. If you're in a wooded area, you know your game is safe. You can box trap anything you want. And if you don't want to eat it, you can some free. Okay. Another thing is you could barter and trade certain goods and items. Now, a lot of people don't realize, well, I could do this, but if 50 other people do the same thing, you're out of the market. So understand your product, how you're going to trade, because a lot of people say, sorry, 40 other guys have the same stuff. Why should I trade with you? It has to be a need. And if you don't have the proper need, nobody's going to buy it. Okay, and I'll catch you later, folks. I hope this helps you out. I'm doing catch up on the videos. Like I said, if something sounds weird from the PTA, school board, anything, vote them out, take control. Because you don't know who's in power right now or who's running the government. And everybody says, oh no, give them a chance. Then you go look at your friend, like, hmm. You've been acting kind of weird. And you let them have it. Because you don't know if they've been replaced, brainwashed, or they're another. One of my hidden messages. Mind-controlled puppets. The Manchurian candidate. Pull the string. So you have a nice day. And I'll catch you later.